after this were the principal men of the families chosen according to their tribes, to go up with their wives and sons and daughters, with their men servants and maid servants, and their cattle, and Darius sent with them a thousand horsemen, till they had brought them back to Jerusalem safely, and with musical instruments tabrets and flutes, and all their brethren played, and he made them go up together with them, and these are the names of the men which went up, according to their families among their tribes, after their several heads, the priests, the sons of Phinees the son of Aaron, Jesus the son of Jostak, the son of Sarias, and Josem the son of Zorobabel, the son of Salathiel, of the house of David, out of the kindred of Pharaohs, of the tribe of Judah, who spake wise sentences before Darius the king of Persia in the second year of his reign, in the month Nisan, which is the first month. And these are they of Jewry that came up from the captivity, where they dwelt as strangers whom Nebuchadnezzar the king of Babylon had carried away unto Babylon, and they returned unto Jerusalem, and to the other parts of Jewry, every man to his own city, who came with Zorobabel, with Jesus, Nehemias, and Zacharias, and Rezaias, Ananias, Mardoshias, Belsarus, Asparasus, Relius, Roimus, and Bana, their guides, the number of them of the nation, and their governors, sons of Pharaohs. 2172, the sons of Saphat, 472, the sons of Ares, 756, the sons of Fethmoab, 2812, the sons of Elam, 1254, the sons of Zathel, 945, the sons of Corbi, 705, the sons of Bani, 648, the sons of Bibai, 623, the sons of Sadas, 3,222, the sons of Adonakim, 667, the sons of Bagoi, 2,066, the sons of Adin, 454, the sons of Adarejias, 90 and 2, the sons of Selan and Azadis, 3 score and 7, the sons of Azuran, 430 and 2, the sons of Ananias, and 101, the sons of Aram, 32, and the sons of Bassa, 320 and 3, the sons of Aphareth, and 102, the sons of Medrus, 3005, the sons of Bethlehemon, and 120 and 3, they of Netrapha, 50 and 5, they of Anatha, 150 and 8, they of Bethsamos, 40 and 2, they of Kiriathirius, 20 and 5, they of Kephira and Baroth, 740 and 3, they of Pira, 700, they of Chadias and Amidoi, 420 and 2, they of Syrama and Gabs, 620 and 1, they of Michelon, and 120 and 2, they of Batalias, 50 and 2, the sons of Nephis, 150 and 6, the sons of Kalamolilus and Donus, 720 and 5, the sons of Jerichus, 240 and 5, the sons of Vanus, 3330, the priests, the sons of Jedu, the son of Jesus among the sons of Sinasib, 970 and 2, the sons of Merath, 1050 and 2, the sons of Phasron, 1040 and 7, the sons of Karm, 1017, the Levites, the sons of Jeshu, and Cadmiel, and Banuas, and Sudias, 70 and 4, the holy singers, the sons of Asaph, and 120 and 8, the porters, the sons of Salem, the sons of Jadal, the sons of Talman, the sons of Dakabi, the sons of Teta, the sons of Sami, in all in hundred thirty and nine, the servants of the temple, the sons of Esau, the sons of Azipha, the sons of Tebeth, the sons of Seraz, the sons of Sud, the sons of Thalas, the sons of Libana, the sons of Graba, the sons of Akua, the sons of Uday, the sons of Seteb, the sons of Agaba, the sons of Sabai, the sons of Anan, the sons of Kathwa the sons of Jeter, the sons of Eris, the sons of Tzin, the sons of Noba, the sons of Chisma, the sons of Gezra, the sons of Aza, the sons of Phinees, the sons of Azair, the sons of Bastai, the sons of Asina, the sons of Mini, the sons of Naphizi, the sons of Akab, the sons of Asipha, the sons of Ashur, the sons of Pharisim, the sons of Basiloth, the sons of Meda, the sons of Ktha, the sons of Cheria, the sons of Charchas, the sons of Aserer, the sons of Tai, the sons of Nasith, 
the sons of Adapha, the sons of the servants of Solomon, the sons of Aphan, the sons of Ferera, the sons of Geoli, the sons of Lozan, the sons of Israel, the sons of Saphath, the sons of Hagia, the sons of Pharaoh the sons of Sabi, the sons of Sarothi, the sons of Mages, the sons of Gar, the sons of Adas, the sons of Suba, the sons of Aphara, the sons of Baradus, the sons of Sabat, the sons of Elam, all the ministers of the temple, and the sons of the servants of Solomon, were three hundred seventy and two. These came up from Thermelith and Thelorses, Trithalar leading them, and Aalar. Neither could they show their families, nor their stock, how they were of Israel, the sons of Ladan, the son of Ban, the sons of Nekodin, six hundred fifty and two, and of the priests that usurped the office of the priesthood, and were not found, the sons of Abdiah, the sons of Akaz, the sons of Adas, who married Aja one of the daughters of Barzelis, and was named after his name. And when the description of the kindred of these men was sought in the register, and was not found, they were removed from executing the office of the priesthood. For unto them said Nehemias and Athrias, that they should not be partakers of the holy things, till there rose up an high priest clothed with doctrine and truth. So of Israel, from them of twelve years old and upward, they were all in number forty thousand, beside men servants and women servants two thousand three hundred and sixty. Their men servants and handmaids were seven thousand three hundred forty and seven, the singing men and singing women, two hundred forty and five. 435 camels, 7,030 and 6 horses, 240 and 5 mules, 5,520 and 5 beasts used to the yoke, and certain of the chief of their families, when they came to the temple of God that is in Jerusalem, vowed to set up the house again in his own place according to their ability, and to give into the holy treasury of the works a thousand pounds of gold, five thousand of silver and an hundred priestly vestments. And so dwelt the priests and the Levites and the people in Jerusalem, and in the country, the singers also and the porters, and all Israel in their villages. But when the seventh month was at hand, and when the children of Israel were every man in his own place, they came all together with one consent into the open place of the first gate which is toward the east. Then stood up Jesus the son of Jostak, and his brethren the priests and Zorobabel the son of Salathiel and his brethren, and made ready the altar of the God of Israel, to offer burnt sacrifices upon it, according as it is expressly commanded in the book of Moses the man of God. And there were gathered unto them out of the other nations of the land, and they erected the altar upon his own place, because all the nations of the land were at enmity with them, and oppressed them, and they offered sacrifices according to the time and burnt offerings to the Lord both morning and evening. Also they held the Feast of Tabernacles, as it is commanded in the law, and offered sacrifices daily, as was meet, and after that, the continual oblations, and the sacrifice of the Sabbaths, and of the new moons, and of all holy feasts. And all they that had made any vow to God began to offer sacrifices to God from the first day of the seventh month although the temple of the Lord was not yet built. And they gave unto the masons and carpenters money, meat, and drink, with cheerfulness. Unto them of Zedon also and Tyre they gave cares, that they should bring cedar trees from Libanus, which should be brought by floats to the haven of Joppa, according as it was commanded them by Cyrus king of the Persians. And in the second year and second month after his coming to the temple of God at Jerusalem begins or Obabel the son of Salathiel and Jesus the son of Jostak, and their brethren, and the priests, and the Levites, and all they that were come unto Jerusalem out of the captivity. And they laid the foundation of the house of God in the first day of the second month, in the second year after they were come to Jewry and Jerusalem. And they appointed the Levites from twenty years old over the works of the Lord. Then stood up Jesus, and his sons and brethren, and Cadmiel his brother, and the sons of Madiabun, with the sons of Jodah the son of Eliadun with their sons and brethren, all Levites, with one accord setters forward of their business, laboring to advance the works in the house of God. So the workmen built the temple of the Lord, and the priests stood arrayed in their vestments with musical instruments and trumpets, and the Levites the sons of Asaph had cymbals, singing songs of thanksgiving, and praising the Lord, according as David the king of Israel had ordained. And they sung with loud voices songs to the praise of the Lord because his mercy and glory is forever in all Israel. And all the people sounded trumpets, 
and shouted with a loud voice, singing songs of thanksgiving unto the Lord for the rearing up of the house of the Lord, also of the priests and Levites, and of the chief of their families. The ancients who had seen the former house came to the building of this with weeping and great crying, but many with trumpets and joy shouted with loud voice, insomuch that the trumpets might not be heard for the weeping of the people, yet the multitude sounded marvelously, so that it was heard afar off. Wherefore when the enemies of the tribe of Judah and Benjamin heard it, they came to know what that noise of trumpets should mean, and they perceived that they that were of the captivity did build the temple unto the Lord God of Israel. So they went to Zorobabel and Jesus, and to the chief of the families, and said unto them, We will build together with you, for we likewise, as ye, do obey your Lord, and do sacrifice unto him from the days of Asbazareth the king of the Assyrians who brought us hither. Then Zorobabel and Jesus and the chief of the families of Israel said unto them, It is not for us and you to build together an house unto the Lord our God. We ourselves alone will build unto the Lord of Israel, according as Cyrus the king of the Persians hath commanded us. But the heathen of the land lying heavy upon the inhabitants of Judea, and holding them straight, hindered their building, and by their secret plots, and popular persuasions and commotions, they hindered the finishing of the building all the time that King Cyrus lived, so they were hindered from building for the space of two years, until the reign of Darius.